So I decided to play with a new um, desktop client today, and I decided to play with XFCE, and I've been using it on Xubuntu. And I gotta say, XFCE, you almost beat Gnome for me. I'm dead serious. Now there's a still things, a couple things I prefer Gnome over XFCE for, but XFCE, if you have not tried it out, download Xubuntu. It is like nothing. Right on a really old computer, and you can see that it's like it feels like you're buying a new computer. That's how fast it is. XFCE is so like compressed; it is just it blows my mind. XFCE is just brilliant. So whoever hasn't tried Zubuntu, sorry about that. I forgot. I better pronounce it right, or the people who make it are going to fucking jam their fist down my throat. Um, but yeah, yeah. Every time I pronounce a Linux distro's name wrong, I get like four comments. OMG! So, yes, if you haven't tried it, it's amazing. I mean, this thing is beautifully executed. There's one thing that pisses me off, I, and I know Tech Computer Man covered this in his video, but I don't know why it does piss me off, though, that I cannot select several icons on my desktop, because usually I just save a whole mess of shit to my desktop, and then I just you know, select it all and put it into an untitled folder or and then rename the folder or something. But with XFCE, that's a really annoying, big annoyance. And it's not only on Zubuntu. I tried two distros of it. And yeah. Yeah. I'm also back to using GOS. And I'm using, I tried the new Spaces. And that thing sucks balls. I honestly hate the hell out of it. I think it's one of the worst operating systems I've ever used. It's in. It's comparable to Windows Vista and ME for me. I honestly, it is so unopen as a Linux operating system. I type in terminal codes and it rejects them. I try everything and I can't really change the appearance that much. It won't let me. It is the most closed source Linux operating system I have ever used. GOS Spaces is horrible. I mean, I liked I liked the GNOME version, and I liked the one before it, but the one before it was extremely buggy, especially on the cloud book. <laughs> but um, the new the new one, it's not even worth your time, guys. Seriously. Um, but I totally got off topic. I'm sorry. XFCE and yeah, I've tried it out, but I'm still going to use Ubuntu Hardy. I don't know if I, I'm kind of sort of sounding like an Ubuntu Hardy fanboy a bit. But I'm not, trust me, I'm still trying out different, different distros. I'm starting to like Fedora 9 a little bit more than I used to. After a couple of updates, it's actually pretty, you know, usable. <laughs> but it's still pretty buggy. So, yeah, Novell, fix that, please. And that's just a couple of updates on my Linux life, since I am totally ignoring you guys, and I'm so sorry. It's just, it's so much easier to pump out a a video game video than it is a computer video. In fact, I have a tutorial on how to browse Mac OS X without a mouse coming up pretty soon. So look forward to that. Sign up.